objectivism say anything about the immortality of the soul? Can things be destroyed? Our soul is something, and it seems that no one created it, but can it also be claimed that it will never be destroyed? Because you can't get something out of nothing. And it's true that things cannot be destroyed in the sense that you can't take something and turn it into nothing. But it is also true that action is not a thing in that sense. An action can cease to exist, which does not involve something becoming nothing, but merely one state of an entity, movement of some kind, becoming another state, namely uh, stillness. There is no nothing going from existence to non-existence if I run across a room and then stop. But the acting has gone out of existence. Now, what do you mean by soul? If you mean by soul a substance of entity, like a spiritual thing on the order of a physical thing, like Descartes did, then, of course, you can't believe it'll go out of existence. But that is not the objectivist view. Soul means consciousness, a certain type of consciousness. And consciousness is the faculty of taking a certain type of action. It's like the faculty of walking across the room. It's like the faculty of seeing. Well, can, that, can the seeing be destroyed? Certainly. Can the faculty of seeing be destroyed? Certainly. For instance, you go blind. Now, that is not something becoming nothing. It is simply an alteration in the state of what is. And since the soul, according to objective, is simply the faculty of consciousness, certainly it goes out of existence when the entity which possesses the faculty and performs that process uh, goes out of existence. So there is no uh, immortality of the soul.